and also by Dale Seasoning. Delicious on all meats, fish, or fowl. Hey, along with the show, along with the show, showboat comes this fabulous cookbook called the Showboat Cookbook, which I'm holding right here, from which today's recipe comes. And here to cook it is none other than my pride and joy, actually my joy, my wife, Joy Harris, who, whom I first met. Oh, you want that? First met cooking. And I want to say, you know, this cookbook has a lot of southern cooking recipes in it, but it also has a lot of other just really good recipes. And the one, and it has a lot of information about showboat to play too. So it's real fun to read, even if you don't like to cook. Oh, but that's the great. recipes that I'm doing today is a roast pork tenderloin with wild rice pecan dressing, and you'll have to help me with the dressing. Okay. okay sure. But first, I want to do the tenderloin. This is just a, a pork tenderloin, and the recipe in the book calls for four tablespoons of soy sauce. But I like to use Dell C seasoning instead. This oh yeah, is, we had some of that last week. Charles Knight brought it in here. It's terrific. And it's it's a soy sauce base, but it has garlic and onion and some other flavors in it, so it works really, really well. And just shake it up, and all you have to do here is add four tablespoons and just put it over the tenderloin, and then you might want to cover it. And sometimes I like to put it in a plastic bag and seal it up, and then just turn it. And you can even add a little bit more. That's probably plenty. And turn it every, you know, 15 minutes or so, and let it marinate for about an hour, and then you bake it for about an hour. And that's all you do with the tenderloin. And then it's done, and it's delicious. I, think, I, I like more of that, because I like the taste of the marination, you know, or whatever Marinate it is. Marinate it a little bit longer. It, well, I'll yeah, give you a little more, more sauce flavor. on it, too. But for the wild rice, what I need is a teaspoon of grated orange rind. Do you think you can do that? You work on that. Now, I only want the orange. I don't want the white. I just want the skin, just the, uh, the top layer there. And to make the wild rice, you use just a, one cup of white rice and a, about a half a cup or less of wild rice. And then cover that with enough liquid, or pour what? enough liquid in the pan just to cover it. Are you not getting, I need it in just a second, now hurry. What's the but difference? But don't break the skin, don't break the white. I'm oh, not, I'm not, I'm okay. not. Okay, cover that. What's the difference between wild rice and domestic rice, or regular one's rice? One's white, one's brown, one's got the shell on it. has a completely different flavor to it. Okay. And the uh, wild rice takes a little bit longer to cook, so you have to cook this for about...